Grandparent Visitation, Wikipedia Audio Grandparent visitation is a legal right that grandparents in some jurisdictions may have to have court-ordered contact with their grandchildren. In the United States, most states have statutes that describe when a third party, such as a grandparent, may ask a court to grant them the legal right to maintain ongoing contact with somebody else's child. Many states have laws that specifically address the rights of grandparents. However, a federal Supreme Court decision called Troxel v. Granville places limits on when states can grant visitation rights to third parties, including grandparents. State laws vary greatly, and no state guarantees that the grandparents will be able to obtain a court order granting them visitation. The rationale behind these laws is that sometimes, especially with the death of a parent or in a family that has undergone divorce, the children may not have the opportunity to have contact with the noncustodial parent and his relatives, thus fostering continued familial bonds. Those opposing this view say that court-ordered grandparent visitation infringes upon the fundamental right of fit parents to raise their child in the manner that they see fit. United States In most states grandparent rights exists however, the grandparent must obtain their own attorney. They will not be awarded an assigned counsel. Organizations are working on some changes in the law to provide grandparents automatic visitation upon the death of a parent to allow for continued family interaction with that part of their family. In the case of Troxel v. Granville, the United States Supreme Court stated that the interest of parents in the care, custody, and control of their children is perhaps the oldest of the fundamental liberty interests recognized by this court. The Supreme Court also made it clear that this fundamental right is implicated in grandparent visitation cases. The plurality opinion stated at the outset that statutes allowing grandparent visitation orders to be imposed over parental objection present questions of constitutional import. The Supreme Court declared that a parent's fundamental right to the care, custody, and control of their children was at issue in this case. The Supreme Court struck down the Washington Visitation Statute because it unconstitutionally infringed on that fundamental parental right. State courts considering non-parent visitation petitions must apply a presumption that fit parents act in the best interests of their children. Troxel requires that state courts must give special weight to a fit parent's decision to deny non-parent visitation. Choices about the upbringing of children, are among associational rights, sheltered by the 14th Amendment against the state's unwarranted usurpation, disregard, or disrespect. This principle must inform the understanding of the special weight that Troxel requires courts to give to parents' decisions concerning whether, when and how grandparents will associate with their children. Even though Troxel does not define special weight, previous Supreme Court precedent indicates that special weight is a strong term signifying very considerable deference. The special weight requirement, as illuminated by these prior Supreme Court cases, means that the deference provided to the parents' wishes will be overcome only by some compelling governmental interest and by overwhelmingly clear factual circumstances supporting that governmental interest. Impact of Troxel v. Granville